Oh, there you go. No way. <laughs> the second I said, I'm going to pack it up and go. Good one. That's a good one, guys. Alright guys, welcome back to another episode of Blood Captain here. Alright, I just got out of work actually a couple hours ago and I went home, changed very quick, got all the setups and everything and here I am at the same spot, we're gonna do some fishing. It's getting late guys, so I'm not gonna keep it too long. Same setups that we used a couple days ago from the previous video and uh, I have wire uh, rigs today that are brought because we lost a lot of bluefish a couple days ago. I don't want to experience the same thing. For that reason I brought the same um, uh, set up uh, one of them. The big one is gonna be about the wire um, Basically line that I attach my hook to I'll show you guys here in a second But anyways guys, thanks so much for tuning in. Thanks so much for watching. Thanks so much for clicking on the video If this is your first time here on this channel, my name is Abdullah Kaplan and this is my channel Born Fish Outer Bags Please consider hit that subscribe button, especially if, it is, if this is your first time and if you already subscribed Give us a thumbs up, please and comment down below if you have any questions. I'll be happy to help you guys and uh, yeah guys, as always, wish me good luck. Let's get back to fishing. Hopefully, fingers crossed, we catch something. And here's what we, we are using today, guys. I uh, cast netted a bunch of uh, mullet, but that was the only one basically I managed to catch. And uh, so we're gonna use this guy, cut him up, and we're gonna cast out there. And hopefully, we'll catch a uh, whatever it is, honestly. At this point, I really don't care. Let's cut this mullet up, and we'll put it on the, on the rods, and we'll cast it out there. And I'll show you guys exactly what we have for setup as well before we casted it out there. So you guys will have an idea about what we are using. Just uh, I'll try to help you guys as much as I can setup wise and everything. Let me turn the other GoPro on to show you guys the setup. I mean the setup you guys already know what kind of setup I'm using. All right. But they so, will give you an idea. Roughly. My Daiwa MKS 12 food guys paired off with my Daiwa BG5000. 35 uh, 30 pound braided line and it goes to my own made drum rig and instead of bank sinker I have a um, um, pyramid sinker today which is five ounces and I have wire leader that I basically attach the swivel right there and um, it goes to a size six really sturdy octopus circle hook and uh, my second setup is my Daiwa MCAS 11 foot rod paired off a 30 pound braided line with my pan clash two 4000 high speed reel and it goes to my own made drum rig this is not wire guys this is basically just classic regular um, nylon or uh, monofilament monofilament line that I use to tie my rig and I have the same hook and it goes to a 5 ounce bank sinker right there guys and uh, this is another sturdy size 4 or size 5 sorry octopus circle hook Alright guys, without further ado, let's cast, let's put some bait on this rod and cast it out there. Hopefully we catch something. Fingers crossed. Let's do this. Alright, so I'm going to put the headpiece on the bigger rod and that small, basically, tail section of the mullet on that small rod. Then we'll cast it out there. Hopefully, guys, hopefully we catch something. I mean, last time, all we were catching was bluefish. And um, hopefully this time, hopefully we can, we can catch some drum and maybe possibly some trout as well that'll be really sweet i'm not planning to keep any fish but honestly guys if i keep a good size trout or a keeper size drum i might consider holding on to it but we'll see we'll see how it goes all right let's cast this bigger rod out there first i have to walk it out here a little bit so i can cover some distance High water. That water level is pretty high still. You guys not might be able to see me right now. Okay. That wasn't a bad cast. Kind of late honestly. I wanted to be out here a little earlier and fish start to fish a little early but just uh unfortunately it didn't happen guys 
but it's all good. Hopefully we still be able to catch some of them or something. Let me give it a little more drag. All right, this rod is out there. I have to adjust this a little bit. There you go. All right, let's cast this little guy. All right, not bad casts at all. But we'll see guys, we'll see how it goes. Put it in the sand spike. And fingers crossed guys, fingers crossed, hopefully. We catch something. Let's hope for the best. Come on, officials. Let's get something. A drum or a trout will be really nice actually this evening. Besides, just something different than bluefish will be definitely nice. But we'll see how it goes, guys. Fingers crossed. Yeah, nothing touched that mullet head, nothing at all. And we got a bunch of grass on there. All right. Let's put one of the bigger chunks right there. Let me show you guys what I'm talking about. A giant chunk of cut mullet. I always leave the tip of my hook exposed. Just like right there, guys. I really pay attention to that. Got to make sure the tip of my hook is exposed. I thought I saw a bent on this rod. Not sure. Not sure. Let's sling this out there. I will check on it after that. Blue crab, what are you doing? What are you doing, little fella? Trying to bite me? Let's see if their bigger piece is gonna make any difference. Come on, where are you fish? Come on now. And sure enough, we don't have our bait left on there. Something took our bait again. Let's use a chunk of this bait. See if that's gonna be any good. It's the older piece of bait. Well, let's see how it goes. Double hook it. Right there. Let's take it out there. And we'll cast it. Put it in here and we'll wait. This is actually magic hour right now, which is, what is it right now? Maybe 5 p.m. ish? Yeah, that's the best time definitely. Oh, 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 there you go guys. Yep, there you go. There you go. 
Holy cow, okay. Yep. There you go. First fish of the day. That is amazing, guys. First fish of the day. I just sit down right here so you guys can see the action. First fish of the day. That is amazing. Wonderful. That is absolutely wonderful. Oh, oh, he's fighting now. Come on, dude. Come here. In ideal conditions, guys, I would have reeled in my bigger rod in so we wouldn't tangle up with the other line. But right now, wow, this is a big fish, guys. But honestly, right now, I'd rather fight this fish. Oh, we just got a jump out of him. That's a good fish, guys. Wow. <laughs> uh, oh, wow. Holy. Another jump. He's hooked up pretty good, as long as he stays on there. Ah, really good fight, guys. Good fight. Maybe we'll be managed. I'm not keeping any fish, guys. Maybe we'll be able to get some underwater. Release. Good fish, guys. Good fish. I'm gonna sling him. Come here, dude. Holy cow! <laughs> Are you kidding me? Massive bluefish, guys. No way. Definitely bigger than the one we caught a couple days ago. What a fish, guys. Let me wash him. We'll show you guys. I will get it back in the water. What a fish, guys. What a fish. That is an absolute monster right there. Big. Ho oh, ho. Big chomper, guys. Big chomper. You. What a fish. Massive. All right. Gonna let him go very quick, guys. Let's get the GoPro. Oh, okay. Okay, bro. All right, dude. All right. We'll let you go. Oh, okay. All right. You're hurting yourself. I'm gonna let you go. Just got to give us a second. We're gonna revive you. And we'll let you go. You're gonna see some blood coming out of its mouth, guys. But that's literally... It is coming out of its mouth. The corner of the mouth. So, uh... It didn't get hurt or anything, if you guys thinking that we might have hurt him. You guys, he's good to go. He's ready. He's ready to go. Good it. I let my hands go. There he goes. <laughs> you wee! So happy we got an underwater footage camera. <laughs> that is all about it right there, guys. Yes, we finally recorded a bluefish release underwater. That was amazing. All right. Let's put another piece of mullet here. Like a similar piece. I'm going to cast it out there again. Man, I had to walk, literally, I have to walk way far out there, and I'm glad I did. We managed to catch one, so let's do the same. Let 
Let's see if we can get another one. Oh God, no way. Is he on? Yep, there, he's go there it goes guys. There goes another one. No way. This one is fighting way harder. Is this bigger? This one is either bigger or it's just fighting harder, guys. There goes another one. He's fighting hard. He's fighting really hard. Oh no, there you go. Popped off, guys. <laughs> As always. Just popped off right there. Might have caught us honestly, I don't know. We'll see if that big one is going to get any action today. Let's see what happened here. It might have caught us honestly. Probably did just cut off. Cut us off, no? No, it just popped off. Just uh just came loose. Wow, that is interesting. Getting dark, guys. Don't know how I don't know how to feel about this getting into water now because it's getting dark. It's gonna be some stingrays right here. But I just want to catch a fish on this bigger rod. I'm gonna slowly pack in, bring all that stuff in the car, and leave this bigger rod out here. Hope that fish will come in, eat this nice chunk of bait. We'll see how it goes. Okay, let's reel this in. might get a quick hit I don't know hope we do <laughs> we I seriously hope we do getting eaten alive by the mosquitoes but honestly it's been a while since I caught any fish so as long as we catch fish <laughs> I really don't care <laughs> Well, let's put this away. Let's go pro and the knife away. Come on fish. That's a big nice chunk of mullet right there for you. See guys, if we don't get a bite here in 10-15 minutes, I have to pack it up and go. Because it is getting dark. Oh, there you go. No way. <laughs> the second I said, I'm going to pack it up and go. Good one. That's a good one, guys. I'm not going to put too much pressure on this one. So we're not going to lose him. I'm getting bit by the mosquitoes like crazy at the same time. That's a big one, guys. He's pulling drag. Thanks God I have the wire on this hook. Oh, it just jumped. Just jumped way far out there. That's another massive one. Hope he stays on. Man, what a fish. This is a big fish, guys. This one took off way better 
than the first one. But I think it is gonna be the same size as the second one that we lost that popped out of the hook. So I'm gonna just take easy on this guy and hopefully we're going to be able to bring it in with no problem here. Hopefully we can land it with no problem. It's coming in with no problem so far. But these mosquitoes are, <laughs> they are getting me. They are getting me pretty bad. Haven't gotten too many head shakes compared to the other bluefish. But we did get a jump though. We got a jump definitely, that's for sure. All right, stay on there, dude. You're right here, stay on there. He's doing all sorts of different crazy head shakes right now. Well, let's hope that we got him good. He's right here. Come here. I'm gonna flip you up on here. You ready? Oh yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. Almost same size guys. Almost same size as the first one. Right on the corner of the mouth. Awesome dude. And just pop right out right there. Alright. Show you guys. And then we're gonna finish the video guys. Awesome fish. Easy 30, 30, 32 inches. Really nice size gator bluefish. And we're gonna let him go right there. What a fish guys. I would like to take you on the water footage, but it's not gonna be good because that GoPro is gonna be extremely dark right now. But well, check this fish out guys. Yee check that tail. Massive head. All right, let's let him go, guys. Yeah, awesome. Second, actually third one. Well, we lost the second one, unfortunately. And this was the third one. And we managed to bring him in. <laughs> God, they're massive. Alrighty guys, I'm gonna finish the video. Thanks so much for tuning in. Thanks so much for watching. I'm glad we didn't get skunked and I'm glad we got some fish for you guys. Love you all. Thanks so much for tuning in. If you haven't subscribed yet, please consider to hit that subscribe button. And if you already subscribed, make sure that you give us a thumbs up. We'll see you guys on the next one. Thanks so much. Really appreciate every single one of you guys. I better get out of here. It's getting dark and I'm getting alive. Eating alive by them mosquitoes. So I love you all. We'll see you next time. You Cheers. <laughs> wow, that was amazing. At least we got a fish on this bigger rod. Finally. <laughs> wow.